Hi Ho. Well, you know, we're coming to the end of our sessions. And I just wanted to kind of get an update. So let me tell me how you how things are going for you. Same as they did when I came in your office over a year ago. I still don't have a man. And the man's not working. Oh. Are you, are you taking the medications on time? Like we spoke about. What about the articles? Are you, did you, are you reading the articles that I gave you? What about the diets? Are you eating the way that you're supposed to? Yes, faithfully. Man, I'm at my wit's end. Please. Please help me. Oh, oh. You are a beautiful, young, bright, intelligent young lady. Okay? Um, you know what? What I'm going to do from this point, I would like to refer you to my colleague, Dr. James Boykin. Okay? Promise me. Promise me you give him a call and make an appointment today. You think he can help me? I, we're trying, okay? Okay. We're trying. Okay, i give him a call as soon as I get in the car. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. James Brooklyn. He does not have an appointment until next month. <laughs> I, I think I just want to cut my wrist right now. Hope, no, no. Hope, wait for, look, Hope, I'm on my way, okay? I'm on my way. I believe I dropped you off at your house before. I think you're just like 10 minutes from me. Oh, okay. I, I hope. I promise. I promise. Okay, I'm on my way. Cross, you cut down. So if you're gonna do this, do this right. Wait. You don't care about me. Hope. Hope. I love you. 
I love you. <laughs> but I can't, I can't make you choose life. <laughs> you have to choose between life or death. <laughs> I never told you. I never told you what happened to me. When I was married, my husband committed suicide. <laughs> I loved him so much. I am so sorry that that happened to you. Oh. I'm sorry. You know, Enough about me. Go with me. Let's turn to let's go to the Bible. Okay. Let's uh let's go to let's read the Bible. John fifteen, okay? As the Father have loved me, so have I loved you. Continue in my love. If you keep my commandments, you shall abide in my love. Even as I have kept my Father's commandments and abide in his love. These things have I spoken unto you, that my joy <laughs> might remain in you, and that your joy might be full. Read this with me, okay? This this is, is my, my commandment, commandment that, that ye love one another as I love, love you. Love you. <laughs> Greater love <laughs> hath no man than this that a man laid down his life for his friends. Hope <laughs> you are my friend. If you do whatsoever I command you, henceforth I call you not servants, for the servant knoweth not what his Lord doeth. But I have called you friends for all things that I have heard of my Father I have made known unto you. Hope God loves you. God loves you. <laughs> wonder I wonder why we don't have a man.